Hey guys. guys! So it's Sunday and that means it's Q&A day. Woo! Q and Trace day. Don't forget it. Since this was the first week of Matt's competition, I asked you guys to ask more fame or lame kind of questions. So this video is going to be basically off that competition, just us talking about our experience so far and yeah. Woo! Woo! Also, it is July and I'm wearing this white jacket because I found it in my brother's closet and whoopsies, I thought it looked cool. It makes me look like, um... You're in a 90s music video. Either that or I was thinking like I was in Naruto. Okay, at JRC2003 underscore JC asked, Q and Trace, are you going to be doing anything special for 10,000 subscribers? By the way, I love you guys so much. Love you all. Oh my god, guys. We are like under 2,000 away from 10,000 subscribers. Woo! And we are excited. Yeah, I, I mean, it's super... I don't know what I'm saying. Go for it. He's speechless. I'm speechless. speechless. Um, we'll definitely do something fun planned. Uh, I don't really know what so far, but um... Yeah, it'll be something, so Expect yeah. Expect something that'll knock your socks off. Yeah. Yeah. Or if you're not wearing socks, it'll put them on and then knock them off. Because it's going to be that good. Favorite person other than yourself? Only pick one. Ooh, out of everybody? Like in the whole wide world? No, I, same or lame. Oh, I forgot. Well, I personally like everybody in the competition. I don't really talk to a couple of them. But I talk to Fee on a daily basis. We yeah. text each other probably all the time, actually. And for me, she's the most, well, just because I know her the most, I know how genuine she is and how uh -huh. sweet and caring and funny and all the great adjectives describing her. Like, so definitely Fee's yeah. probably, Fee's definitely my favorite in the competition. I love Fee too. She's one of the most genuine people I've ever met in my entire life. I also really love Carol Ann. I think Carol Ann is super funny and sh her videos always make me smile. So it's it's hard to decide between those two. I love them both so much and yeah. At Pedra underscore OK asked, if you guys were to win Fame or Lame, what is the first thing you do? Love you guys. Love you. The first thing we do is probably cry and be like, oh my god, and like write it like an acceptance speech and film it. Like I like to thank like my mom for like giving me a camera and Chase for like being alive and you guys. Like I would probably cry actually. Uh-huh. I would cry too. And I would hug you a lot and thank everyone. Grace and Sparky. Grace, you we're sassy. filming. That's my dog. Q and Trace, which one of you is the better dancer? Also, good luck for the next round. You'll both oh, do great. Thank you. Thanks. So, um, talent-wise, I think Chase would be the better dancer, but we're both not good. No. And this was actually the challenge that I was dreading. If we'd have to do anything, I would not want to dance. I'm not looking forward to it, but we're gonna we have do some our tricks. best. We yes. have some tricks under our sleeves and we are ready for this, actually. Yes. So. yes. And luckily, if we make it past the dancing round, everything else will be great because the dancing was the one we did not want to do. So, yay! Woo! <laughs> Lainey asked, Hugh and Trace, did you notice that you hit 8K on YouTube? Woo! We yay! did! Ow. Sorry. Oh. God. <laughs> yes, we did. And... We want to thank you guys, all the new subscribers. Thank you so much. We are completely touched and we love each and every one of you and lots of other mushy gushy stuff and yay, 8K, woo! Woo! Christina asked, Q and Trace, did you have fun competing in Fame or Lame? Congrats on making top eight. Oh, thank you, Christina. Yes, it is super, 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 super fun. Um, it's fun getting to meet new people, new people supporting us. Um, supporting just, new people. Yes, and just making new friends like Fee out of this competition. It's been a blast. It's been... I've never been in anything like this before. I've never done anything like this before, and it's so fun. That's my violin. Yeah. Oh, and also, like, being on Matt's channel is like... <laughs> Whoa. Like going from watching him in my dorm room by myself for like 
two years. That's so creepy. So like being on his channel is so weird to me, but hey, yay. Thank you, Matt. Abigail asked, how did it feel when Matt chose y'all? As a huge fan of Matt, I can't imagine. By the way, I love you guys so much, Q and Trace. We love you too. Okay, I don't know if I've told this story before on here or not, but I'll tell it again. So I was in the middle of peeing. I just woke up and I was mid pee. And all of a sudden my phone just goes like doo 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 doo. And I was like, what? And I saw like um, email from Matthew Lush and I like freaked out over it. I was so in shock reading it. So I like immediately, well actually I like tiptoed to chase his bed and I like dog piled on him and I was like, Chase! Ah, Matt emailed us, we're in it. And he was like, what? And I was like, yeah. And he was like, what? And I was like, yeah. And he was like, no way. And I was like, yeah way. And he was like, no way. And I was like, yeah, way. And he was like, oh my God, okay. And I was like, yeah. And yeah, that was pretty much it. Yeah. Heaven has asked. Hugh and Trace, what was your reaction when you made it through to the first round? I love y'all so much and we love you too. Uh, when we made it through to the first round, we were just overcome with excitement and motivation to do our best going forward. That was our one goal coming into the competition was to not go home the first comp like the first episode. And we didn't go home. Yeah. And in fact, we actually got a lot of support from you guys and we love it and we love you and thank you and mwah and mwah. Mwah. I guess I gotta thank you too. <laughs> Yeah, you should. Heaven also asked, who is our least favorite contestant? I don't honestly have one. Like, okay. there's people, oh, I wasn't, I was I, like, like, there's people I don't <laughs> talk to. Like, I don't talk to, actually a lot of the other guys. I talk to Ian and Brendan, uh -huh. but um, I don't really talk to. I gravitate towards women naturally. I don't know, like, but I do not dislike anyone in the competition. Mm -hmm. I wish every one of you luck and hope you all make it as far as you can make it. Like, that's great for every one of you. Mm -hmm. And as far as I'm concerned, we already made it, guys. We made it to the top 12, yeah. now the top 10. We've met a lot of wonderful people, guys and girls. Yes! So congrats to everybody in the competition. Laura asked, Q and Trace, how does it feel to be part of this competition? Love you and so proud of you guys. We love you too. It feels so great to be a part of this competition. It's opening so many doors and it's just, it makes me feel so great because YouTube is what I want to do and YouTube is what I'm doing. So yay! It's like a new chapter has opened. For real, for real. Yeah. Q and Trace, please adopt me. Q and Trace says yes. Our last question is... Tabby Cat asks, Q and Trace, are you guys living together? If not, are you going to live together soon? I love you guys. Love you too. Uh, yes, we do live together. We've been living together for the past year and yeah, so. Yep. We do live together every moment of every day. So there you guys have it. That was our Q and Trace for the week. If you guys asked one and it was not answered, please try again using hashtag Q and Trace on Twitter and we will get to you. We love you guys so much. Thank you all for your votes and your support. Guys, we made top eight. That's so great. That means there's only seven other people to beat. But even if we don't win, that's okay too. But yeah, top eight. Bye guys. Bye.